Prince William's attempt to divert attention from the problem that everyone is interested in, the disappearance of the Princess of Wales to the distant Gaza, which is far from the British, failed. British journalists are already outraged by the silence of the palace. The disappearance of the king could have provoked a crisis of power in Britain, so Charles does not hide. He continues to appear in front of the cameras, perform his duties and accept the condolences and support of his subjects. The disappearance of the Princess of Wales and even the Prince of Wales will not provoke a crisis of power. The relations here are completely different. After Kate Middleton married Prince William in 2011, she showed herself in the best light. She did not complain, did not rebel, clenched her teeth and worked on matching her new role. It was not easy. She was criticized, especially at the beginning, as harshly as Meghan Markle. But Kate did not break down and did not run away. At the funeral of Prince Philip, a journalist called her the rock on which the modern monarchy rests. Remember how she skillfully led the brothers, princes, to a conversation. Then her Christmas concerts began, where she played the piano, and the audience felt admiration for their future queen, and journalists called her the English Rose. In the pair William and Kate, Kate leads and everyone sees this perfectly. So the sudden disappearance of the princess is a big problem for the prince. This is a blow to the reputation of the monarchy, and to its image, and to the image and reputation of the Prince of Wales himself. The subjects have since 2011 managed to simply humanly love the beautiful young mother, who is always in a positive mood, does not hesitate to laugh openly in front of the cameras, and in a difficult moment always puts her shoulder. Suddenly, the princess, whom the people already rightfully consider their own, suddenly disappears. All talks about confidentiality are untenable in this case for one simple reason. Imagine that a person who has been winning your favor for years suddenly abruptly breaks off any contact with you and disappears. What will you feel? The same thing that all those people who were used by Meghan Markle in her life felt, and when they became unnecessary to the Duchess, she just broke off contact with them. This feeling is called disappointment. Why are people disappointed? Such a heartless attitude does not fit with the sweet image created by the image makers of the Princess of Wales. Creating the image of the princess, they pulled exactly this thread, touched the emotions of the subjects. The subjects had to not only respect the future queen, but also love her. The task is completed. Now the crown simply has no moral right to say, go away everyone, calm down and wait. When necessary, we will start pulling on the emotional threads again, and now rest. Since the image created for the princess is stronger than that of the prince, the first person whom people suspect of being involved in her disappearance is her husband. It is easy to list more than a dozen rumors, one scarier than the other, about his role in this situation. British journalists are also offended. The British press is forced to feed readers with old information and scanty rumors about what is happening behind the closed doors of the palace. They discuss last year's outfits of the princess, voiceless stories about how all relatives and friends act as a united front. William cooks chicken with curry, children cook soup, friends bring baskets with spa and sweets, a new assistant ironed a suit and is ready to start providing assistance at the first signal. The situation becomes simply ridiculous, as the columnist of the Daily Mail Amanda Plato says. She calls for an answer from William, who so clearly tried to divert the attention of society to the problems of the Middle East that even the most naive people understood. This is not for nothing. There is nothing to fill the information vacuum around this topic. Stories about the next oddities of the Sussexes are of no interest to anyone, Amanda writes. Can we even remember a time since she, Kate, married William in 2011, and that she was not in our lives for so long, smiling and laughing at official events, or with her husband and children? Her absence seems almost a heavy loss, so much we are used to her. Wherever I go, to the hairdresser, to the butcher shop, to the store, 
even to the street. People ask me about Kate, who think that I might have some information about the princess, but I don't, because I am a journalist. Everyone is desperately trying to find out what is going on. How is she? When will we see her? But there is radio silence. If Charles can openly talk about his condition, why can't we hear about how Kate is doing? William has calmed his interest in the problems of the distant Middle East. There is no information about the hearings of those who participated in the events. But he is still so upset that he is unable to combine his royal duties, and he promised to lighten the king's schedule with taking care of Kate. His royal diary remains empty, which causes slight bewilderment in the near royal circles. His friend says, William really can't choose one side in this matter. Either he keeps calm and continues his own program of caring for his wife and children, then people say that he is not active, or he takes a step forward, and people think that he is trying to take the place of the king, or, worse, that his father is no longer able to work and he needs the hare to step forward. 